Hello, YouTubers. All right, today I'm going to show you um, how to actually, I guess you call it decrapifying your PC. Now, if you ever go to a store and buy an OEM uh, computer, that's pretty much a store-bought computer, or if you order from a manufacturer, uh, any other way besides buying it yourself, uh, in simple terms, uh, that's called OEM, and it always comes preloaded with all kinds of trial software, uh, spyware in some cases, uh, even rootkits in other cases. Uh, there was a computer manufacturer got in quite a bit of trouble for doing that. Well, here's how you decrapify a new PC right out of the box. Or if you have an old PC and you just want to get some more crap off of it, it works for that too. So in, open Internet Explorer or Firefox. Go to Google and type in PC decrapifier should be the very first link welcome the PC decrapifier so left click it left click version 2.10 released on the left click download and click download now click uh, left click save file once it's saved, double click it. Click yes if you're using Vista or 7. Alright, now this is the crap of decrapifier. You can check for updates if you want to, but you just download the most recent one. Uh, so click next, click next, click next. It's going to ask you is this a new PC out of the box? Uh, if you just brought it home from the store, you want to click yes. If you built it yourself, or if it's not right out of the store, if it's a couple years old or month old or whatever, uh, you can still hit yes, but I'd probably click no. Uh, in my case, I'm going to click no because it's not a new computer. You can click a restore or make a restore point before you start decrapifying in case you remove something that you didn't want to remove. Uh, so if you want to do that, just go ahead and click that. You can't reset one on mine because I have system restore off. But yours will pop up and create a restore point. So after that, click next. Now this is um, things that start up with your computer. This is the sidebar, which is this thing over here. Uh, I want that there, so I'm going to uncheck that and hit next. This is all the programs that this program considers crap. Uh, a lot of it's not crap, uh, so be careful what you check. Uh, it's basically and add remove programs menu just like uh, 7 or Vista has or XP any version of Windows but you scroll through here and you find out what you don't want now if you took it if you just bought it and brought it home out of the box the odds are you can check just about everything because uh, it probably all is either trial shareware freeware or crap uh, so just scroll through here find something you don't want check it I probably don't have a lot in here because it's custom built computer. Well, that's all I have really. Uh, but you'll see, you'll see a lot of stuff with Office, Office Trial. Uh, you'll see uh, probably double click now or there is uh, what does it start with? Um, I can't remember the name of it now, but it's big game list. It's uh, notorious to be on HP's. Uh, it's got like 50 games in it. It drives you nuts. Uh, so just go ahead and just check which, you know, what you don't want. Uh, and then just hit next. And it'll say removal of process will now begin. So just click OK. Am I sure I want to remove malware bytes? Yes. Are you sure you want to remove that? Yes. All right, once it's all done removing, except for that one, uh, just click Finish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you have just decrapified your PC as far as trialware and freeware comes on an OEM-type computer. Store-bought. All right, well, I hope that helps somebody, YouTube. And as always, if you need help with anything or want to learn how to do something, just leave a comment or email me at who took the names.
2000 at gmail.com.